Hello everyone, welcome back to episode 2 of my embarrassingly cringe adventures on MSN. Now if you know what MSN is, it was basically like WhatsApp, an older day version of WhatsApp. And without further ado, let's just crack straight on with it, shall we? Here we go! So today we're looking at two different conversations. We're starting off with one of my best girl mates, Sandy. And then later on, I'm gonna introduce you to a new character who oh, you'll, you'll find out later on. So I said to Sandy, Hello! She said, All right, mate, he? Yeah, I'm all right, thank you. We thought we saw you Saturday, but it wasn't you. Did you go to see Bath play? Bath is our like local rugby team. Go Bath. Yeah, all the action was down your end, angry emoji face. Yeah, I was pretty annoyed. I'm tiny anyway, and I couldn't see anything. Lol, but I got Ollie Barkley's autograph, and I got a pic on my phone, spelled F-O-E-N, right? Of me and Danny Grucock. Oh, I corrected myself, phone. She said, Hell, how did you do that? I said wait a few minutes after the match I know like, a lot of people when we do like meet and greets and stuff I know a lot of you are well switched on and you know where to sort of wait afterwards to get a glimpse or to see us leaving the venue See I was like you a long time ago, you know, I knew where to wait to meet the stars I'm not saying that I'm a star. I'm just saying that I'll show you the pic to Moz. He's huge compared to me. She put I bet to be fair Everyone was huge compared to me back then but saying that here is the picture of me and Danny Grucock like, look at the actual size of me <laughs> compared to him. I shook his hand and said, well played. Lol, he did play very good. And his hand loke wrap around mine. I was like, bloody hell. She put, lol, hee hee. Classic Sandy. I said, haha, did you see David Thomas at half time? Who the hell was David Thomas? She said, huh? Yeah, I'm also confused. What do you mean, David T Oh, the little Britain man, I think. She put, yeah, haha. -ha. I said, yeah, I saw him. Oh, bit of communication breakdown there between me and Sandy. That's fine. He climbed back over the rail and slipped and hit his balls, haha. -ha. And the mascot got rugby tackled. Class. Ugh. Christ. So David Thomas is one of Matt Lucas's characters from the TV show Little Britain. Anyway, haha, <laughs> funny stuff. Gotta go, mate. Bye. Love ya. I feel like I was always the last one to come off MSN. Everyone sort of left before I did. The following day. Hello, matey. Smiley face. She said, Ah, yeah. I said, You okay? Yeah, you? Yeah, I'm okay, thank you. Good, good. How was your day? Ooh, she put, Haha. <laughs> Absolutely shockingly stressful. And I felt like, <laughs> But I'm now, <laughs> Fab. That was a quick turnaround, Sandy. Good on you. I said, Good, good. Why did you feel bad? Look at me, the, being the caring friend. I love this. Because something happened, but now I'm all good. Are you, are you gonna tell me? Are you, gonna, are you gonna tell me what happened, or just gonna just gonna be that be that annoying person? Oh, good, good. Yep. Yeah. She put, good day then, babes. I said, yeah, not too bad, thanks you. Why did I say that? She put, I've already asked, ain't I? I said, nope, I asked you. Oh, I've already told you. Haha. <laughs> I don't quite know what's going on here. Very, very young, confusing chat. But then she said, how's Hermione, hun? Oh no, we're back on the subject of good old Hermione. I said, oh, haha. -ha. Um, good, I think. Still level to bits, smiley face. Cringe. She said, bless you. I put, haha. -ha. She put, suits. I put, huh? Lol. She said, I said, cute. <laughs> I said, oh, it said on mine, you said suits. Ha <laughs> ha. She said, ha 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 lol. She did, she put suits. I've got physical evidence right here. She said suits. This reminds me so much of that scene from the Inbetweeners movie when Neil was driving the camp van and goes, oh, bop, 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 bop. And then Jay goes, what did, what did you just say? And he goes, I said, what time is it? And Jay goes, no, you f***ing didn't. You said, bop, 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 bop. Uh, I put, look on my Bebo, at my pic, on my photo album. She put, okay, okay, okay. Three okays there. She, oh, this is me showing the picture of me and Danny Grucock. Oh my god, he's muddy, ha ha, he he. She said, he's so big. I know. I was like, whoa. She said, haha, imagine if you ran it into at his full pace, Joe, you'd be dead, haha. I said, I know, nah, I dump tackle him easy, lol. I'll be as big as him one day. And as you can see, from look at me right now, it, it never happened. Then I said, should I get a mop chop again? Or go long? Or keep it how it is now? This is about my hair. I didn't know what to do with my hair back then. I need a girl's advice on hair. You want to impress girls, so why not ask for girls' advice when it comes to how a men's hair should look, you know? Being smart. She said short again. Or ask Hermione. Haha. <laughs> she says long, but I prefer it short, to be honest. So then Sandy says, so how is stuff with Hermione? Is she still coming on Friday, yes? I said, yeah, this is the first time she's ever been near my house, haha, haha, -ha. maybe she'll go in, ha 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 ha. I said, haha, -ha. I wouldn't mind. Classic, cheeky, naughty. Uh, if the weather gets cold or we get bored, we can go to my house if you all like. She said, hee hee, you and Hermione in the bedroom, ha 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 ha. Then she said, joking, hee hee. And I said, ha ha ha, with a tongue pokey outy smiley. Probably like cringe that my keyboard would be like, no, 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 I can't, I'll, I'll freak out if a girl likes me, ah, help. Then I said, Leon's bringing a film up if we get bored, haha. -ha. She said, wicked, haha, -ha. 
You and Hermione can sit at the back of the room, lol, alone. Hee hee hee. I said, ha ha, yes, smiley face. She said, easy, tiger, winky smiley. And then I said, nah, bet Leon will be sitting with her or something. I will be like, oh, thanks, mate, lol. She said, I'll push him out of the way. She, she's got my back. She was the perfect wing woman. Give credit to her. Sandy knew what she was doing. She said, yeah, if Leon or Leone sit next to Hermione, I'll go, stop, sit next to me. I, I need a hug and try and look sad or something, lol. Ha <laughs> ha. I was like, okay, we should make a little plan. And then she put, gotta go, honey. Love you lots. And then, and then just left. So I said, okay, bye. Love you too. Thanks. Kiss, kiss, kiss. We should make a plan. Yeah, well, no, I'm going now. See you later. Okay, I'm going to leave my chat there with Sandy. We're getting ready for the big event on Friday. Who knows what's going to happen? You'll find out in the next episode. I want to focus now on another person that I used to chat to all the time at MSN. He was one of my best mates that I knew even before school people and stuff. I've known him since, like, day one. And I'm going to call him Jonah. Jonah was also the sort of guy that your parents tell you not to hang around with and spend your time with because... He's a bit of a naughty influence, but I loved him and you'll see what he's like from these chats. Also, I just want to point out, Jonah is the most forgetful person I've ever known. He would always leave my house and leave something behind. You ready for this? Hello, you left your phone at my house. Darn it. If Emma texts you, just flirt loads of her, lol. I put, lol, who's Emma? This girl, lol. I put, lol. I said, what happened to Jenny? Then I said, BRB, and he put, KK. I said, touching cloth, which in other words means I'm about to uh, poo my pants. And then he messaged me saying, lol, I said the hottest, eggiest fart ever, lol. <laughs> so I said, so how was your first day back at school then? He was also in the year above me at school. He put, Sh lol, so tired. I put, ha 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 ha. While you were doing mathematical equations, I was skating. We were both really into skateboarding, by the way. He put, I got back at 12. I put, oh yeah because of your penis on your book, lol. So he got back home at 12 because he got sent home from school because his maths teacher saw his maths book covered in pictures of penises. He drew a giant willy on his maths book and got sent home early. Great influence. I turned out fine, don't worry. So the next day I put, yo, he put, all right, mate. I put, yeah, I'm good, you? He said, I'm good, cheers, mate. Woo boo too, which means what you've been up to. I said, not much really, you? He said, had a house party, lol. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of expected that. I said, lush. Where were your parents? At this party. I put, oh, lol. Did they know you had people around? Yeah. I put, oh. He said, was quality. My mum didn't mind as long as nothing broke or got muddy and no one was sick, lol. I put, haha. Did anyone break anything or be sick? He put, nope. I put, well, my game's downloaded. Tigerwood 7. Whilst you're out having house parties and stuff, I'm there downloading golf games for my PC. Just shows. Two different lives, but we're still, we're still good mates. Then another time I said, our heating's broken, so we've got no heat in our house. How f is that? Unhappy smiley face. He put, lol, brr. All in all, I got like 500. 500 what? I'm so confused, Jonah. Haha, <laughs> not from me. I'm warm, lol. I just got my snowboarding stuff on. In brackets, knew it would come in handy. Spelt C U M, which always makes me feel a little bit, a little bit uncomfortable nowadays. He said, haha, <laughs> like my fake passport? Question mark. And he sent me a picture of a fake passport. Once again, he was a great influence, I promise. I put, ha ha, I said, how come it's fake? Once again, it's about C-U-M. Stop it, Joe, please. So I was like, how come it's fake? And he said, says I'm 18, lol. Beer, 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 exclamation mark, exclamation mark. But you look seven in it. He said, lol, it's a passport photo. You don't have to look old. I put, oh, ha <laughs> nice. So my good friend Jonah, once again, whilst I'm out downloading golf games, he's there having house parties and creating illegal fake IDs. He was a good friend, all right? That's all that matters. Then again, I put, yo, yo, yo. He put, all right, mate. I put, yeah, you. He said, I'm ace, cheers. Had a lush house party on Saturday. I put, lush. At your house, question mark. Yeah, 90 cans of beer, lol. Steady on, Jonah. Be careful. That's fair. 90 cans is quite a lot. I'd probably have like five, and that'd be, that'd be me done for the night. 90, he's, he's got a screw loose. I said, haha, I saw the Bebo pics. I got lucky as well, lol. I put, haha, who? I said, is it one of the girls that, who goes to my school? Question mark. Then he sent me a picture of these two girls. And he said, she's the one on the left. I said, oh no. <laughs> then I said, bear in mind, how, how old was I here? Probably like 14. What do you mean by in quote marks, got lucky. Haha, <laughs> up in my room. Lol, in my bed. I was like, I still don't understand. What do you mean got lu What do you mean got lucky, Jonah? I don't know what that means. And then I think it clicked. I was like, uh, I said, haha, <laughs> shocked face. What the full third base or whatever it's called. No, oh, no. He said full, lol. I put, oh, really? She goes to my school, I think. And he said, yeah, she does, lol. Classic Jonah. 
So there we go, I'm gonna wrap the video up here. I hope you enjoyed it. We are carrying on the conversation with Sandy, gearing up for that giant party on Friday, which we're very excited for. Will I end up getting a kiss off Hermione? Who knows? And we've also introduced Jonah. There's a lot more chats with him. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you next week with another Sug Sunday special. Cheers, goodbye. Don't forget, username uprising is now out. So you can get it from your Waterstones, your Tesco, your Sainsbury's, if you want signed copies. Also, you can get it online, places like Amazon.